Hello! I'm going to be going over the things that I'm bringing with me to Namibia. I am leaving in about a month to join the Peace Corps. I'm going to be an education volunteer. Um, these are all my clothes that I will be bringing and some shoes over there. And all of that fits into this hiking backpack I have. So I have a hiking backpack and this is a cover duffel bag for bringing it on the plane. Um, I'm not going to go into too much detail. But I have two hats, two swimsuits, two cardigans, two sweaters. <laughs> um, I have this is like a workout tank top and a bunch of just cotton t-shirts um, to sleep in or to do yoga in or whatever. I'm not packing that. But <laughs> I have two quick dry towels, or this is technically a washcloth I guess because it's so small. I have some bras here. Next I have these um, sports <laughs> shorts, whatever they're called, I don't know. Two pairs of three-quarter leggings. I have scarves up here, so that's a heavy scarf for um, in the winter or at night when it's cold. Then I have a bunch of lightweight scarves. Um, this is a vest, a feather down vest. Um, fleece, lightweight hoodie, and t-shirts. Yeah, and this is my one tank top <laughs> that I have. So I might need to buy more tank tops, but... Then I have some... Well, these are blouses for work. Um, and these are sun shirts. That's what I call them. They're like long sleeve sun protection and they're for the heat and stuff. And maybe I could wear these to work. Um, I don't really know. This one doesn't look very pretty, but it's really good for the sun, so. That's why I have it. Okay, I have four skirts here. Whoa. And they're all at least to my knee. Um, so I have two maxi skirts and two midi skirts. Then I have three pairs of pants, a pair of jeans, skinny jeans actually. Um, I was reading the welcome packet and in the packing section it says that they are really into fashion including skinny jeans. So I was like, well, here's my skinny jeans. <laughs> and these are travel pants and maybe, maybe I could wear them to work depending on how strict their dress code is. Then I have shoes, flip-flops, Birkenstocks. Shoes for work, which are super, super comfy. I used to wear them at my last job. And witches for weddings and swearing in and all that. I also have this dress here, which I didn't pack down, but this I'll be wearing at swearing in. And I have two other dresses there too that I didn't feel like packing. Or didn't feel like putting on the ground. <laughs> okay, I don't have any socks or underwear packed down here or put in a pile on the floor right now. Next is all this stuff on my bed. Ah! These are reusable bags for groceries or moving or whatever. You, I always need those. I always use those here in the States. Sleeping pillow. This is the only pillow I'm going to be bringing. So hopefully it'll hold me over on the flight and perhaps on the ground as well. This will be my carry-on. I have some jewelry. This is not a lot for me. <laughs> but yeah, some jewelry, a pair of sunglasses, stuff about Namibia, and this is all my Peace Corps paperwork, I'm, my welcome packets, my assignment description, and all my vaccination records and everything in here. Headbands, a bunch of headbands to keep my hair out of my face. I have a, this is a buff, this is a cool scarf, um, which hopefully will work and keep me cool. Okay, next I have this lone knife or whatever I'll need it for. I have some essential oils. Woo! I love essential oils. Um, my other toiletries are 
pretty limited. Uh, the only thing I don't have in this pile is hmm, shampoo. I think I'm going to bring some shampoo. Um, and I didn't put my razor or my toothbrush in here yet. What is it called? Foundation. Um, I don't really use it that often, but every once in a while I might. And then a thing to put it on with. Uh, comb hair clips. Jojoba oil. These are just things I use here at home on the reg. Um, and then this deodorant. This is my favorite deodorant. I don't know if you can really see that. Then this is a bag of makeup, which I'm not really going to go through, but it's... Oh, I'm not bringing two of these. <laughs> yeah, it's just basic makeup stuff, whatever, I don't really care. Um, you can always buy makeup there, so I don't want to bring too much of that. And a mirror. Hee <laughs> hee! Whoa, that needs to be cleaned. Okay. Ah! Also have a sewing kit. I use this all the time here. It's great for repairing things. Tissues. Fan. So this is awesome. The makeup cloths. Vitamins. Two water bottles. This one is double insulated or whatever. A comb. Yoga mat hammock. I have a bunch of green tea. That's like 50 packets of green tea. I love green tea. Um, I think I might also bring granola bars and spices and stuff because I recommend that. Depends on if it fits. <laughs> um, and then for electronics, I don't have my laptop over here. But my laptop and my charger are obviously going to be packed. And I have these Bluetooth headphones, Bluetooth speaker, charging cord for those things, external hard drive, a um, Zoom H1 voice recorder. This is a USB charger for the camera I'm using, headlamp flashlight. This is actually really cool. Up with, so you blow it up and it inflates, and it's a little solar light. It's really cool. Um, dust protection for my computer. Now this is also solar, and it's a cr also has a crank. You can charge it with USB and charge a phone. has a radio. All that. School supplies. <laughs> I also haven't put all my school supplies over here yet, but this will be my school supply section. Mostly just paper, pens, pencils here. Um, so I am bringing a lot of books. I might have to take some of these out because there's kind of a big stack of books. But it's I have some journals down here, some notebooks, um, then just some books that I want to read various things. There's still some stuff that I may be purchasing, but other than that, yeah, this is most everything. Wow. Wow. I can't believe, I can't believe it. This is my room, by the way. <laughs> my room here in Boston. Wow, I'm gonna miss this place. Hey there, buddy. <laughs> what are you doing? Why is there a spoon over there? What have you done? <laughs> what are you doing? You're so silly. I'm gonna miss this guy. Hopefully all that stuff will fit in. So we'll see. But till then, Peace and love, and good luck if you are joining the Peace Corps, and thanks for watching.